Hi, Mark Victorson from Pacific Golf Club. Well, we're continuing our battle plan here for Pacific. Hole 17, what a great little par three. Now, most golf pros have got really big golf bags so they can put their ego in them. I don't care anymore that I don't hit the ball as far as I used to. You know, I'm going to use enough club to get the ball up into that middle section of the green on the fly because it's a fairly narrow, narrow entrance coming in with a reasonably long club. So we've got about 175 metres today. So I'm going to take my little hybrid out. I'm just going to try and start the ball, you know, into the biggest section that I can see between the, the bunker on the right and, the, and that front bunker on the left. So just try and work a little draw in from there if I can. A little bit of breeze out of the right, so that will certainly help. And it's a little bit into today, so here we go. That middle of the green, so I'll take that one. So here I've let myself down below the hole, probably a, a 20 footer. That, I'll take that every time on this hole because the par threes here are, are quite challenging. I think even the 13th that we've had uh, rebuilt is proving to be a challenge, even though it's only 110 metres or whatever. So any time I can knock it on the green, you know, one of the things I, that, that Peter Thompson said: if you want to make more birdies, putt for them. So anywhere on the green you're a chance. I think you're more chance with a putter than any other club. So if I can get the ball up onto the green, that's great. One of the dangers here is if you hit it a bit long and left, it's easy to kick off the down slope of that bunker and go into the water over there between uh, hole 17 and 11. So if I can get it on this midsection of the green, I'll take it every time. I'll take three every time in. 